Hey guys, good morning and welcome back to another week in my life vlog. This week we are going to be waking up at 5 a.m. every day. I really wanted to challenge myself and see what would happen if we woke up at 5 a.m. every day. So that's what we're doing this week. Today is Monday, day one. We woke up at 5 a.m. I was definitely a little bit stressed about actually waking up to my alarm. So I kept waking up a bunch of times before my alarm actually went off. But we did it. We woke up at 5 a.m. and got up and got our day started. I went through my usual morning routine of meditating, journaling, and reading. Got that done and it is about 6.15 right now. And we are going to get our workout in. I personally love working out in the morning. I have to work out in the morning. It just never happens in the afternoon or evening because I'm so unmotivated by that time so we gotta get it done first thing or it never happens so we are going to find a workout i think i'm going to find a youtube one an upper body arms one that kind of sounds like the move and then we are going to get our day started our week started of waking up at 5 a.m I have about an hour and 15 minutes right now before I need to start work for the day, so I want to get a few different things done. The first thing I need to do is pack and ship my Etsy orders. I have a few orders from this weekend, so we're gonna go pack those and drop them off the mailbox. After that, I wanna work on editing my video for tomorrow a little bit, probably like 30 to 45 minutes, depending on how long I have, and then we'll make breakfast before starting work for the day. That is the plan. I'll probably use this extra time a little bit differently each day. Some days I'll probably work on videos like today. Other days I might start work early so I'll have more free time in the afternoon totally just depends how I'm feeling and what I need to get done for the day today pack and ship orders edit video that is the plan so let's go do it It's 9.57 right now. I've gotten so much stuff done this morning. I did pack and ship my orders and work on editing a video. I got two of the five days of the work week vlog edited or at least rough cut. So doing pretty good with that. And then I hopped into work at nine. I caught up on all my emails and messages and just kind of got myself in order for the week. And now I've been working on Instagram engagement and we're gonna wrap that up on this meeting that I have to hop on at 10. And then I have my staff meeting at 11. So lots of meetings in the morning, but then we have the after afternoon free. I have a very long to-do list this week for work, so we need to get a lot done. But first, we're going to hop on these meetings and get engagement done for the day, and then we will see where the rest of the day takes us. It is 2.28 right now and I've definitely hit a little bit of an afternoon slump. I'm feeling really, really tired, but we're trying to push through and be productive. I finished all of my engagement this morning and had my staff meeting and then I took my lunch break. And then for the last little bit, I've been outlining two blog posts that I need to write this week. I really wanna get at least one of them done today. So we're gonna try and just sit down and focus on that and get it done. I did get myself a snack, some cinnamon chip things that I got. I don't know. They're like pita chips with cinnamon and sugar on them. So I got these to hopefully kind of wake me up a little bit, a little bit of sugar. I have some YouTube videos playing in the background. So I'm just going to sit, get in the zone and try and get at least one of these blog posts done today. I really would love to get both of them done today, but that's just not super realistic. So we're going to try and get at least one done and then maybe we'll have time to work on something else. My to-do list is very long this week, so we got to get at least one thing done. So we're going to sit down crank this out, have a great afternoon, even though we're a little bit tired. <laughs> Week in my life vlog session. Wait, wait, there we go. Okay. Yep, for the vlog. Hello. 
I finished up work for the day. I did get my blog post done and then I also tailwind scheduled for a client for a full month. So feels really good to get all of that done. I knew I was not going to get two blog posts done, but at least I got one of them done and I got it all uploaded and ready to go. So that feels good. After work, I FaceTimed my friend Jillian. I haven't talked to her in so long. She was in South Africa for a few months and it's just really hard with me being on the West Coast and her being in South Africa to kind of be in the same time zone and chat. So we decided to FaceTime now that she's back in the US and it was just really good to chat about YouTube, video ideas, just everything. I don't know. It was just really good to catch up. Now it's time for dinner. I'm really hungry. So I'm just going to heat up leftovers. I forgot that we had leftovers. I should have eaten them for lunch, but I'm just going to eat them for dinner, especially because Brian's not here this week. So I'm just going to eat what is in the fridge and make do with that. And then we are going to work on, and then we're going to finish up editing the video that I was working on this morning. I am going to hopefully finish it pretty quickly. I don't want to stay up too late working on it. I'm already really tired. So I want to go to bed early because we are waking up at 5 a.m. again tomorrow. So we're going to try and wrap it up quickly and get it done and get it ready for tomorrow. Sorry, princess, we're going to bed. It is 9.27 right now and I'm just getting into bed. I wish I had gotten into bed a little bit sooner, but I wanted to finish scheduling my video for tomorrow and I did get it done. It's all ready to go for tomorrow morning, so I don't have to worry about that. But I did stay up a little bit later than I would have liked because I still need to kind of read and unwind because there's no way I'm going to fall asleep right this second if I go to bed right now. So I'll probably read for about 30 minutes and then head to bed. Day one of waking up at 5 a.m. wasn't too bad. I definitely got pretty sluggish in the afternoon, but I don't think it was too bad or too much worse than a normal afternoon slump. It was definitely a little bit worse, but not significantly more, if that makes sense. Hopefully the rest of the week is a little bit better once I get used to a little bit more, and hopefully I can get better sleep each night so that I'm not as tired. We'll see how it goes. I'm gonna update you throughout the week on how it's all going and how we're doing. I think that's it for today. Overall, a pretty successful Monday, and now it's time to go to sleep. Good morning guys, happy Tuesday. I'm going to be 100% honest, it was very, very rough getting up this morning. I slept terribly. I woke up so many different times and just like could not stay asleep. So it was definitely rough this morning. Probably gonna take a nap later on, but for right now, we're just kind of pushing through. I finished my usual meditating, journaling, and reading, and now we're gonna get our workout in. I'm hoping like moving around helps me wake up a little bit more because I'm very tired and I'm trying to not be tired, but it's hard. Not gonna let my tiredness stop me from having a great day. We are going to be super productive and get a lot done. We're manifesting it right now. That is the plan. First, let's get our workout in and then we will get ready for the day. It's 7.45 right now and I just finished getting ready for the day. I'm going to spend the next hour doing different type of admin things. I have a few different emails I need to respond to and I also need to sign and send my taxes. They're all filled out and everything. I just need to actually sign and send them. So we're going to kind of do all of that for the next hour-ish. I really want to use this extra time in the morning each day productively, not just sit and scroll on social media. So I'm going to try and put my phone away, not look at it, and really just be productive and get what I need to done today. And then we'll go make breakfast before starting work at 9. That's the plan for the day. It's nice and sunny today. I'm feeling really good and motivated right now. Even though I was a little tired, we're feeling a lot better after our workout and showering and everything. So let's go. Happy Tuesday. Yeah.
It is 12.01 and I just finished all of my work for the morning. I got all of my engagement done and I got a few other kind of admin -y things done too. So I'm really happy about that. Also, I used the time before work so productively and I got a lot of little random things that I've been putting off done and responded to a bunch of emails. So that felt really good as well. So overall, we've had a very productive day so far. Now it is time for lunch. I'm gonna go make something, probably a frozen meal, and then figure out what I'm gonna do during my lunch break. I think I'm gonna go on a walk with Rosie because she needs to get outside and get moving. I didn't take her on a walk yesterday because it was raining. So I think I'm gonna go take her on a walk after I eat and chill for my lunch break. And then we will figure out what we're working on this afternoon. I need to do some Instagram scheduling, some captioning, a bunch of random things. Slowly but surely making our way through my to-do list for the week. I've crossed off quite a few things, but there's still so much on it. So need to have a very productive afternoon. I just got back from my walk with Rosie and it's time to hop back into work now. The first half of lunch, I ate lunch and watched some YouTube videos and then we went on a walk. Rosie is still panting back there because it is pretty warm today. Now I'm getting back into work. I don't really know what I'm gonna work on yet. I kind of need to figure that out first. And I have Naked Juice. I know these are not the best for you, but I can't eat most fruits because they hurt my stomach so bad. I feel like it's better than nothing. If you have like a healthier juice, option or know what is better than naked juice besides like actually eating fruit because as much as I love fruit it messes me up so we have this naked juice I only drink half of them at a time so I feel like that's a little bit better and it's not as much sugar I don't know we're just trying to be healthy but also struggling with stomach problems I'm gonna drink this I hop into work and have a good productive afternoon that is the plan It's five o'clock and I just finished work for the day. I am absolutely exhausted, but if we nap now, we will not sleep tonight. So I need to just stay awake and make do. I think I'm going to chill for a little bit and read before making dinner. I'm gonna make taco bowls because those are the best. But before that, I need to just kind of chill and unwind after work, but also not fall asleep. So I'm probably going to read a little bit. I watched a ton of YouTube videos while I was getting all my Instagram scheduling done this afternoon. So now we're gonna read for a little bit, chill, unwind, then we'll make dinner. It is 9.15 and I am more than ready for bed. I never ended up taking a nap today, so I'm just very, very exhausted. I'm hoping I can go to sleep quickly and stay asleep until the morning. It wouldn't be too bad waking up at 5 a.m. if I actually got a decent night of sleep. So we're gonna hope that tonight is a lot better and that we sleep well tonight. I said tonight way too many times in that sentence. But overall, again, kind of the same thing as yesterday. I felt not too bad throughout the day until the afternoon and then I definitely felt in a slump and very tired and I think it was a little bit worse today just because I didn't sleep well last night. So I'm hoping that if I sleep well tonight that I will be better tomorrow and we can have a super energetic awake and productive day. I still was super productive today, especially at work. I got a lot done. I didn't really work on too much after work because I'm not uploading a video tomorrow, but tomorrow I'll definitely hop in and start working on my next video and get that done. And I think I'm going to film another video tomorrow too. So we're going to have a super good productive day tomorrow. We're going to get a great night of sleep. We're going to manifest that right now. And we're going to have a really good day tomorrow again. Good morning guys. I'm gonna be honest, I slept like trash again last night. I'm really just not good about sleeping by myself and with Brian traveling for work, just sleeping on my own does not work even though I know our roommate is here, like he's just down the hall. 
my brain does not like that so i woke up from a nightmare and then was just in a panic and could not go back to sleep oh so, really we've been awake since 3 30 today but i didn't actually get up till 5 because i was tired and i'm still pretty tired but also there's no way i would be able to sleep right now so we might as well get up and be productive i finally got up at 5 and put on my workout clothes and brushed my teeth and then i actually got back into bed to do my meditating journaling and reading normally brian's still in bed so i come downstairs and do it but i thought i would just do it in bed today since I was not feeling the best, but I still wanted to get it done. So we did it. The sun is beautifully rising now and I'm about to go on a walk. I'm gonna go on a hawker walk as TikTok would say. I think I'm gonna go for like an hour and walk around. And then at the end, we're gonna go get Starbucks to treat ourselves for not sleeping well. That's the plan for this morning. I'm determined to make today a great day still. I will probably take a nap later on because I have not slept at all this week, but that is okay. We can still have a super productive morning and get a lot done. I'm gonna head out on my walk and I will see you guys later when I come home. Hello guys, it is nine right now and we are about to get started with the work day. My walk was really good. It was like an hour long and I went to Starbucks and got some coffee and a croissant and ate it there and it was so nice to just sit in the sun and have a little moment. Really nice way to start the morning and then I came back, got ready for the day and I had to pack and ship an Etsy order and then just do a few things on my computer. But now we are ready to start work for the day. I'm gonna hop in and start with engagement so that we can get that done as early as possible and then I'll have the afternoon free to keep work on Instagram scheduling and write a blog post. Those are like the two main things that I need to get done today. My to-do list for this week is still very long, but we're trying to power through the big things at least because most of the little things can be pushed off if needed. But those are like the two main things that I really need to get done this week and really should get done today. Okay, I think that's it. We're definitely a little bit tired, but we're gonna push through, power through, start with work and get it going. I actually just went and reheated my lunch even though it is only 11:20. since i went to starbucks so while i was on my walk i definitely ate breakfast a lot earlier than i normally do so i'm very hungry so i decided to grab my lunch early to eat but i do still need to get some work done before i take my lunch break and i'm gonna take a nap on my lunch break because i'm absolutely exhausted so i'm gonna keep working while i eat and try and wrap up some things for this morning i did get all of my engagement done so that's good but i want to try and wrap up a few other things before i actually take like my lunch break and take a nap because your girl is dying, but that's okay. We're gonna push through, persevere. We're still having a really good day. I'm just very tired. So that's the update. I'm gonna hop in, keep working, and watching YouTube videos in the background. Okay, hello guys. I ended up taking a lot longer of a break than I thought I was going to because I took a nap. It was so needed. I was so exhausted even waking up from the nap. So I'm glad I did that. And then when I woke up from my nap, I ended up filming a video. I wanted to film my monthly planning, reset, whatever you want to call it. So I did film that. And that means I'm going to be working a little bit later today to kind of make up that time. And normally I really try not to do that and work like normal nine to five hours. But since Brian's gone, I really don't have anything else to do. And I want to get a little bit more work done for the day so we're probably going to work later than normal and that is okay i did finish the project i was working on earlier i didn't have to get it all done today or this week but i just wanted to be done with it because it's kind of a one-time project we're doing for a client so i just wanted to get that done and off my plate so i don't have to continue to worry about it so i'm glad that i wrapped that up completely the other project i want to wrap up today and not have to worry about is write a blog post i am finally almost done with this project i have one more blog post to write so i think i'm going to just sit down right now and crank it out and if i get that done then i will will be so happy because those are two major things crossed off my to-do list and then anything else that I need to get done this week we can work on wrapping up tomorrow and Friday but with those two projects done I will be really happy so I think I'm going to spend the next little bit writing this blog post trying to get that done and then we will probably wrap up the work day shortly after that.
like on my side, I guess. Hello guys, I ended up working till like 5.45 or 6 to wrap up that blog post, which I did get done, thankfully. So now we are done with this blogging project, done with all the blog posts that I need to do. And I got a few other things done before I could be done for the day. I still have a lot to do tomorrow and Friday, but I'm glad I got everything done today that I needed to. I didn't feel like making dinner for just myself, so I ended up just having cereal for dinner. Could be worse, but that's what we had. And then I finished editing and scheduling my video for tomorrow. So that is all done. We have three videos this week already, and I'm planning on uploading one more on Friday. So very busy all this week, very productive on top of my YouTube grind. It is 9-11 right now, and I'm about to get into bed. I'm probably gonna read for about 30 minutes and then go to sleep. I'm very, very exhausted after waking up at 3.30 this morning. And even though I took a nap, I'm still very tired. So we're gonna go to sleep, really, really hoping that I can sleep better tonight. I'm so bad about sleeping by myself, even though I know I'm not actually alone because my roommate is right down the hallway. It's just a problem and I didn't really realize how bad it was because Brian hasn't been traveling and we've been together like every single night for I can't even tell you how long. So definitely been a struggle. I honestly might order myself a nightlight. I know maybe that makes me like a child, but whatever helps me sleep. I'm really need something so that I can actually sleep the night when he's gone, especially because he's going to be traveling a lot more for work now. I don't really think I've talked about my sleeping struggles on this channel too much. It used to be so bad as a kid through high school and even like part of college, like waking up at 3.30 all the time or waking up in the middle of the night and not being able to fall back asleep. I, I don't have too much of a problem falling asleep. It's waking up in the middle of the night or waking up really early in the morning and not being able to go back to sleep. So hopefully it's not as bad tonight and I might look into ordering something to help me sleep because definitely a struggle and I like waking up at 5 a.m. and being super productive, but it's really hard if I don't sleep at all. Okay, that was a ramble and a half. I'm gonna get into bed and I will see you guys tomorrow for another 5 a.m. wake up. Good morning guys, happy Thursday. I did end up sleeping so much better last night. I did wake up a few times still, but I was able to go back to sleep every time, which is really the most important part. And I woke up and got my day started. It is 6.07 right now, and I already did my meditation, journaling, and reading. And now it is time to get my workout in. There was an Apple Watch challenge, I don't know, Apple Fitness challenge, to do a dance workout today. I think it's International Dance Day or something. So, decided to do a dance workout today so I can get that little badge thing. I, it means nothing, but it's still exciting, and it gives me an excuse to not do an actual workout. I'm gonna do my workout, and then we'll get ready for the day and figure out what we want to do with our extra time this morning. I just finished getting ready for the day. I actually decided to do my hair and makeup so I look a little bit more put together. And it is such a beautiful day outside so I decided to wear this flowy skirt that I got from American Eagle and it's gonna be a great day. We're gonna make it a great day. I have about an hour before I'm gonna start work for the day and I think I'm gonna take Miss Rosie Kins here on a walk right now. I have a call at one, so I don't wanna have to like rush and do it during lunch. And then it's going to be pretty warm this afternoon and I feel like she won't really want to go later. So I'm gonna see if she'll go on a walk with me right now. Like I said, it's a really beautiful day. It's already like a really beautiful morning outside. You cannot see that. I wanna just go and enjoy the sunshine this morning before sitting down at my desk. Hello guys, I just wrapped up all my work for the morning. I got my engagement done and I also just got a bunch of admin things done. I needed to fill out an ads report, fill out my weekly analytics, fill out a meeting agenda for tomorrow, just 
just a bunch of little things that I needed to get done today and I still need to pull end of month numbers too. That's going to be a priority of mine this afternoon and also working on a bunch of captioning. I want to make sure all of my captions for all of next week are solid and ready to go since I'm off on Monday. And normally on Thursday we make sure we have through the weekend but I want to just make sure everything looks good for next week. Those are kind of my main priorities for this afternoon. I'm really making my way through my to-do list for the week. Like I said it's very very long but slowly but surely we are crossing things off and getting through it. I'm going to take my lunch break now probably going to watch some videos and just chill while I eat lunch. Okay, I really forgot to pick up the camera and vlog anything this afternoon. I've honestly just been working, 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 trying to get so much stuff done today so that I don't have to leave it all until tomorrow. There's still quite a few things that I need to wrap up this week. So just trying to work and get it all done. It's five o'clock right now and I think I'm gonna keep working for a little bit longer because I really don't wanna have to do it all tomorrow and I really want to make next week not as bad either. And since Brian is gone, I might as well just keep working and try and wrap this up. Currently have the NFL draft on in the background it is just about to start because we are anxiously awaiting to see who the 49ers pick really hoping it's Justin Fields we'll see what happens and my roommate just went to pick up dinner for us we're getting the habit so we're gonna eat watch the draft wrap up work for the day um, I'm pretty tired but not too bad honestly so overall feeling pretty good I have everything laid out and ready to go for my last morning of 5 a.m. wake ups. I have my workout outfit, so I can put that on first thing. I have the book that I'm reading, my journal, my headphones, everything's ready to go. My water is also full, so we can just hop up in the morning and get ready for the day. This definitely helps so much with the 5 a.m. wake ups because I can just get up and grab everything and I don't have to think anything through. Everything is ready to go and it is time to get into bed. Going to read for a few minutes and then head to bed. Today actually felt a lot better than the last few days. I don't know if it's because I slept a bit better or just because I'm getting used to the 5 a.m. wake-ups But I didn't feel as tired today as I have the last few days. This is something I continue to do long term I definitely need to be able to sleep better and probably take a nap some more days And I feel like it wouldn't be too bad I just need to make sure I'm getting enough sleep But I do really like the early morning wake-ups and I'm able to be super productive and get so much done Going to set my alarm for my last 5 a.m. Wake-up. I'm not going to do this over the weekend It's just not happening. So Friday will be our last day tomorrow ready for for the end of a week. I have my like must use tomorrow for work and I'm probably gonna start work early so that I can try and be done with work early for the day and then it can be the weekend and I have a three day weekend because I have Monday off. Really going to try and be as productive as possible in the morning so I can be done quicker with work because I just have a few must use that I have to get done this week and everything else I can finish up next week. That is the plan for tomorrow but we are getting ahead of ourselves. I need to sleep first, get a good night of rest, sleep, and I will see you guys in the morning. Good morning guys, happy Friday. The sun is shining, the birds are chirping. It's gonna be a great day. It's already been a great morning. I woke up at five and like hopped out of bed today. Who am I? I don't know. And I got my usual morning routine done and I just finished getting ready for the day. I have makeup on, my hair looks good. Who am I? Determined to make today a really great day, be super productive and get a lot done. It's eight o'clock right now and I'm actually going to start work in just a little bit. Like I said yesterday, I want to start early today so hopefully I can wrap up early. I have a few more things on my to-do list that I have to wrap up this week. So I wanna just get those done as soon as possible and then everything else we can focus on next week. If you've seen any of my work week vlogs, you know I really like to stay scheduled out and stay ahead. And I feel like the last week or two, I've been having to do a bunch of things that have a deadline and that really stresses me out. So I'm trying to wrap up all of those things and then be able to just keep working in advance so I don't have to be worried and stressed. Today's gonna be a great day. We're gonna go make ourselves breakfast and then sit down and get right to work.
wrapped up work for the day for the week i cannot believe how much stuff i got done this week i crossed off almost everything off my to-do list and all the things that i absolutely had to get done this week there's a few things that got moved to next week but a very small amount and my to-do list for next week is so much smaller than it has been the last few weeks so i'm really excited about that it is 6 27 right now and my roommate and i actually just went to the grocery store to pick up some things one of our friends is coming over and brian is on his way back he should be landing any minute and so we're just gonna hang out have a good evening so i picked up some ginger beer for moscow meals and just some snacks and things so that is the plan for the evening i don't know how much i'll vlog we'll probably be playing like video games and stuff and just hanging out so that is the plan for the evening i already said that but i'm really excited and i'm ready for it to be the weekend the only issue is i feel like i'm probably going to crash eventually because i woke up at 5 a.m i really should have taken a nap this afternoon that probably would have helped but we're gonna try and power through and stay awake as long as possible and hang out with everyone